Vic, the last bodies had something written on them. This one didn't. I'm failing to follow you. Can't be the same guy as what I'm saying, right? Before you start trying to link this to Maldonado and all the others. There are more factors to consider than the messages, Rusty. This doesn't fit your pattern, Cole. End of conversation. Understand? Phelps and Galloway, LAPD. We're investigating a case, and one of your laundry labels came up. F-1363. If you give me a minute, I'll go find a register, and you can take a look. You take a look for yourself. I've got clothes that need pressing. I wrote the number down that dress, is it there? Go to this one. And where exactly are we going? I've got a feeling we're about to meet another wife killer. You've always got that feeling, Rusty. Yeah, and it's usually correct. Please, please, for once, can you not let your assumptions color your detective work? Just you wait. The Nordic types show a particular disposition for this stuff. Yes? Detectives Phelps and Galloway. Is your wife home, sir? My wife went out last night and she hasn't come home. Can you describe your wife and what she was wearing? We were out at a friend's place, Bobby Ross's, for a party. She was kind of dolled up. She had her green silk dress, open-toed white shoes. Those are her favorite shoes. Can we come in, Mr. Tarleton? I'm afraid we have some rather bad news. Do you have someone who can look after your children, Mr. Tarleton? I've been trying to arrange a sitter. Look, tell me what's happened. I'm afraid your wife was murdered last night. Her body was found this morning. I'm very sorry for your loss. I know this is a difficult time, Mr. Tarleton, but we are going to need you to answer some questions. First, we're going to take a look around. What for? You don't think it's that... procedure. You see to your girls.
Stay here till Daddy's finished talking to these men. Where's Mommy? Everything's gonna be all right, sweetheart. We would like Mommy to come home now, Daddy. What's the problem, Terrelson? Let him search. You got nothing to hide. You wanna hear something funny, Terrelson? Some bums think filling out a missing persons report actually rules them out of the I wonder why the picture was turned down. Check if she was a regular. Circumstantial. This isn't what we're looking for. I doubt it. sweet on this dive. If you'd excuse me, ladies. So she went out without her handbag? She'd have to be in quite a state to leave this behind. We can see if Pinker can match the impression of the crime scene. Lars was out in the rain last night. I'll be out of your way momentarily, ladies. For the record, Mr. Tarleton, what is your wife's name? Teresa. When was the last time you saw your wife? Around 8.30. The card game at Bobby's was wrapping up. I played out my hand and drove home here. I paid the sitter and went to bed. Why did you only report your wife missing this morning? I thought she would have called up last night from the bar. <laughs> Mr. Terrelson, was Teresa happy at home? Yeah, I think she was. But not last night. She wanted to go dancing. I wanted to stay at the party. Do you have any idea why anyone would want to hurt your wife? No. Everyone loved Teresa. She was so full of life. It can't be anyone who knew her. For the record, Terrence, did you kill your wife? Oh my god. This is... No. I didn't kill my wife. And fuck you for suggesting it. <laughs> you said you went to a party at Bobby Ross's place? That's right, Bobby had a bunch of people over. We were having a good time. She said she was bored and decided to leave. You let your drunk wife leave the party and go off on her own? 
Look, I was angry. I was having a good time. She has to go and ruin it. We always have to do what she wants to do. Last night she wanted to go dancing. Any idea where? Where she always goes. A bar down on North Beaudry Avenue. Baron's Bar. She goes there, drinks too much, gets maudlin, and calls me. I go and bring her home. If Bobby Ross doesn't confirm your story, we are going to come back here and pick you up. This doesn't look good, Lars. Appreciate your time, sir. Everything here is going to be relevant. Operator, give me dispatch. Putting you through now. Phelps, one, two, four, seven. How can I help, detective? Can you run an address for a Bobby Ross? Then send some uniforms over. Would you like him picked up? No. Suspect says he was with Ross last night. We need to confirm the alibi. Get a proud car dispatched. Thanks, ma'am. Isn't he the cop? Leave this guy story. story. Kind of rings true. We're here now. 